In his remarks at the meeting, the Transition Committee Chairman for Njikoka Local Government Council, Mr. Charles Okungu, reminded the people of the need for Apoga to remain united by supporting those who has worked tirelessly for the development of the state from the federal, state and local government levels, noting that Chief Wanko deserves re-election to consolidate on his achievement. <laughs> The Commissioner for Tertiary Education, Science and Technology, Professor Teresa Obekezie, commended Chief Nwankwo for carrying his people along and being a responsive leader, noting that the gathering of all who came to support him picked volumes, pointing out that his re-election would do more for the people. Responding, Chief Nwankwo appreciated the people for their support, without which he said he could not achieve much, assuring that he will never disappoint them, as according to him, the development of his constituency remains his utmost concern to upliftment of lives of the people. I do my own foundation before my house. So when I have a house, when I find a house, if another house is awful, I want to get a house now. Every month. As long as they are on board, they have free health care. But they have one year old, if one ever got it. So now, as long as I continue, that is a little bit of a goal. Then, me and me, I think that they provide the package. So, these three years, you know, they will go experience, and they will be exposed to the workings of governments. The town hall meeting was attended by President General, party leaders, and Apuga faithful, among others. From the Njikoka local government headquarters, Abagana, it's been Kenechuku Chukwode for ABS News.